Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, I'm doing another walk. And I do plan on doing three miles today. Um, plus do 100 calories on the bike. Um, so, I wanted to kind of talk to you guys because I failed a little bit, you know? I won't necessarily say fail, but I'll put it to you this way. I, so let's see, in the past couple days, I have not exercised. And then yesterday at my job, um, we had something going on and there was junk food to say the least, you know, the good stuff like pizza, there were some cookies, stuff like that. I'm not mad at it, you know, I had two slices of pizza, like four cookies <laughs> and yeah. But earlier that day, I got my hair done. As you guys can see, I got my hair done and I had Sonic, which I had the three piece chicken tender like basket or whatever. And I had a cherry limeade, which I should have got diet cherry limeade. But it pushed me back, you know what I'm saying? And now I'm here making up for it. What I could have done better was when I was getting my hair done, I should have packed my lunch. That's something I should have done better at, you know? I should have packed a lunch. As for last night, I probably should have packed my dinner. But... I'm not mad at myself for eating the pizza. I'm not mad at myself for eating the cookies. You know, I just knew that today I was going to have to do more than I would have needed to do had I packed my lunch. So, here I am. That's kind of my mindset right now with this whole weight loss stuff um but you know it is what it is we just get back on it we get back into the mindset and we just know better for next time yeah all right so i just walked a mile and now I'm doing 50 calories on the bike again. So that'll make 100 calories in total on the bike. Um, and then I'm going to go walk another mile, come back, do another 50 calories on the bike, walk another mile. I'm telling you, it's literally the consequences of eating the stuff that you like sometimes, but it's okay to eat the things that you like. When you're trying to lose weight and you eat those things, you have to burn it off. And I know like after I did that, I didn't eat until about maybe 1.30ish. Um, this afternoon because I still wanted some of that food to get digested and stuff like that. Um, and I'm still like trying to watch what I eat and stuff. Like I'm probably going to have chicken noodle soup for dinner. The whole can, not just half of it. I'm going to have the whole can. I might have cheese and crackers, pickle. Stuff like that. I'm still going to be eating, but I just want low-calorie foods 
today, not like nothing bulky. To, I don't want anything to eat bulky. So, yeah. I had my um I had my lean shake for breakfast, which is why I feel bloated now, but <laughs> I had that. That way I'm making sure I'm getting some pro making sure I'm getting some protein carbs and fat. So yeah. I'm not trying to starve myself. I just need like low calorie type stuff today and that shake was 180 calories so yeah I'm probably I've already burned that off but I still feel like full and bloated so I'm good right now I'll probably get a snack after my second mile or if I feel a little bit hungry I'll eat it after this bike sesh I'm not trying to starve myself I don't believe in that so yeah that's where I am right now with this. And I'm kind of taking you along with what I'm doing today because I did not eat <laughs> properly yesterday, but it was good. I'll say that the food was delicious. <laughs> okay. okay, this is mile two. We're getting it, you guys. We are getting it. Those cheese and crackers are actually really good. So, what we're going to do next when I'm done with this mile is I'm going to get back on the bike for 50 more calories. I'm going to chill, let my dog eat his dinner. Um, Yeah. And then we'll probably go back out and then he can use the bathroom if need be. And that should be the end of it. But knowing me, I'll probably do something else like some sit-ups or something like that. So, because I'm really, I'm starting to feel like better and more energized now that I'm doing this. I'm picking myself back up. Because when I woke up this morning, I was beat. I was tired. I was sore. So, it's working, whatever I'm doing. And I'm feeling good. And I'm feeling like myself again. So, let's keep going with this. So, I basically just got done with the bike. And now I'm outside taking a break. Um, I'll give myself about 30 minutes because I got to feed my dog so we can go for our last mile. I'm doing pretty good. Um, I think my adrenaline is starting to like pump up some, but I know tonight I'm going to be tired. I'm going to be sore once I stop um, exercising. The last thing I'll probably do today is do some like sit-ups and yeah sit-ups with weights but yeah so I'm excited um I'm almost done with this and I'm proud of myself you know it's an accomplishment I stuck with it I did it even though I didn't want to I was feeling very sluggish and I think it has to do with my diet yesterday and you know it's it's okay I pushed myself and that's what's important and I'm back on track so as long as I can get back on track, there's no issue with having two slices of pizza, having four cookies, having Sonic. You know, it's it's okay. I just got to keep going in order to get back on track and stuff like that. So, yeah. I'll see you guys on my next walk. My last walk at that. All right, you guys. Mile three. This is it. I think I'm done for the day. <laughs> I'm tired. My dog. Boo, where are you? Yeah. He's tired. We're both tired. But we did it. And that's what's important. Um, I don't know. 
if I feel like eating soup for dinner, I might just have a smoothie with some protein in it. So yeah, <laughs> smoothie with some protein in it, a lot of protein and yeah, we got to be proud of ourselves for this. My dog should be proud of himself for doing it. I'm so proud of you, boo-boo. I'm so proud of you. And then when he goes back home to eat, he can just lay down and chill, do whatever he wants to do. He can sunbathe, all of that. So, <laughs> hmm. Whew. But I had to do what I had to do. And I did it. So, I'm gonna finish up this walk. Probably go home and make that smoothie, take a shower. Oh, I'm also gonna stretch because you should always stretch. I'm gonna massage. I have a massager too that I'm gonna use on my muscles. And I'm laying down and I'm gonna study because I need to study. I have a test next week. This is my spring break, so I have a test next week. So I need to study, 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 because I got to pull up my grade. So, yeah. Hmm. So my dog is eating, which means I did three miles oh my gosh i'm sore i hurt but i feel good i did 150 calories on the bike 152 because i went too over the other time but yeah you guys i feel great and i'm proud of myself i really am proud of myself for pushing myself um, tomorrow won't be as strenuous. Um, I gotta go to work tomorrow. So, um, tomorrow should be pretty chill. But I'll still be burning calories and stuff like that. I feel great. Um, and yeah. I'm gonna insert my stats right, um, after this clip. And I'm gonna go make me a smoothie. And yeah, um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video um it's something different you know it was me taking accountability for the things that i ate yesterday and me showing you how i was going to combat that and whatnot but i really hope you guys enjoyed this video um and yeah i'll catch you in my next one bye